We can start it, though. Okay. You apologize a lot. Um. You're about to say I'm sorry, weren't you? That, yeah, my impulse was to apologize again. So. And welcome, welcome back to We Know the Devil. I'm KM. And I... Shit, I didn't know if I was going to say B or Doc. It's B. Hi, I'm B. <laughs> All right, and we are continuing the game. Also, I noticed there's a belt on the screen, and I didn't yeah. notice that before. I'm just pointing this out. Also, I know we were doing character voices, but I don't know what they were. <laughs> I remember what they were. I sort of do. Uh, you were going to do the narrator this time, because I messed up my Am voice I? last time. Okay. What am I doing the nar- narrator voice in? Am I doing an up and a voice? Sure. I don't have to. It was just no, 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 no. Go ahead, go ahead, go okay. ahead. The road there is through the woods, but not far. We just follow... <laughs> if you giggle, <laughs> I'm going to giggle, and it'll, okay. we, we okay, won't okay, get okay. anywhere. Okay. Oh, sorry. sorry, sorry, sorry. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, we just follow the sirens to where they're covered in vines, and their lights don't work so well anymore. Ellipses. Um, it's fine. It's fine. We still can't quite believe it's a house humans are supposed to spend a night in. (laughs) Uh, The fact that you base that voice on an alien cat girl makes that even funnier. (laughs) Thank you. It has electricity, unbelievably, and also illegally, because it could likely burn it down and kill everyone. Huh. Continuing. What is it? I'm trying to think of something positive to say, but, uh, I can't. It's a work of actual art. I'm truly impressed. In all kinds of ways. Seriously, I'm in awe. No ordinary idiot built this cabin. An ordinary idiot would have given up long before this. It takes a truly extraordinary idiot to keep at something he has no idea how to do. God, I want to make a political joke. (laughs) I think you just did. I think it's right there. I pray we never have to meet him. Uh, just keep rolling. Hmm. What? I was just thinking. I was just thinking that it hasn't cut to my character in a while. <laughs> I'm just talking to myself. It's like, guaranteed the captain built it, right? If you tell a joke with a face that straight... Someone impressionable like Venus is going to believe you and be terrified for the rest of their life. I'm totally serious. Can't you imagine how proud the captain would be of himself? He'd never think he was doing a single thing wrong, right? I mean, with that face. (laughs) There's like half a dozen horrifying shacks here. He must have had so much fun. God, hold me, please. You've chilled me to the depths of my soul. Look at that little smile. It's cute. (laughs) What is that face? Jupiter snapped her hair tie against her wrist. There's something wrong with the lock. Is it broken? We're doing, we're actually just reading it this time. We're doing less fucking around. (laughs) Is that, is that a good thing or? I don't don't know. know. It's a mystery. It's fine. Her expression was gay panic, though. Okay. All right. I'll accept that. Well, yeah, because it's like, hold me now. Like, "Ah, ah, ah, ah." (laughs) I don't hear any static. It really is broken. That's so dangerous. No one would leave it unlocked like that, would they? No, they wouldn't. They could have broken it and not told anyone. That'd be just like Group East. I almost read that as fast, and that is not correct. I think Group South was here last. Which group are we, West or North? 
or, or west. Or do we also have northeast and northwest? Or... I don't know. Okay. Or them, or anyone. They're all jerks who'd rather let the next group take the fall than fix it. So what does it matter which one it was? The crystal and whisker look fine. It's like someone tried to tape it together. But it must have come loose. What the fuck are they talking about? I have no idea! Do, do, do they mean whisker like the thing on a cat? Or whisker like the thing to beat eggs? I... I have no idea. A crystal a crystal a crystal whisk would be amazing until the first time you used it. <laughs> it could have already been like this, but this kind of charm okay, so it probably is a whisker. This kind of charm doesn't break that easily. I don't think you just need to make sure the wire is securely touching the what the fuck is that word? Galena? What is that? I need to Google that, Galena? but my phone's over there. <laughs> Galena? Jupiter relaxes slightly. She is more worried about the devil than any of us, but all of us are worried. Is it like a protective charm? Maybe? Shrug? Question mark? Though, not that worried. She doesn't even know what it is. I don't even know what it is. It is a mystery. It's lead glance. It's an ore. Okay. Uh, I'm learning things today. This is an important ore of lead and an important source of silver. All oh, that right. makes sense. Because silver is a, 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 a curative. Like if you get an infection during a piercing, if you use a silver uh, ring, you'll clear up the infection. I did not know that. Again, I'm I, learning things today. I learned that from a movie called Ginger Snaps about werewolves and puberty. Okay. We should watch that sometime. Humans are much more likely to kill you than the devil is, statistically. Oh, who do we want to pair? Um, well, do you want to talk? <laughs> <laughs> or do you, you know want what? me to talk to myself? <laughs> you know what? I think that's what we did last time. Was, uh, hey, I need to talk some, because you also did that one group, all three different voices. Right. You know what? Uh, you choose. All right, you can so, make me talk to myself if you want, but it's up to you. All right. Th this time we'll do Venus. And, we did Venus and, and Neptune last time. Yep. So we'll do Venus and Jupiter this time. And next time we give the option, we'll do the. The, the bee talking talk to, to themselves hour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's probably the bee not talking an hour. To, the bee talking to Doc. Because <laughs> okay. you couldn't figure out what name you wanted. Okay. There's probably some wire in that weird little in the weird little shacks in the clearing out back. That was a very musical line I just said. Have fun. Ah! Oh my. Oh my, spooky basement. Oh, yeah, me. <laughs> <laughs> this shack is full of shelves and drawers, all neatly, maniacally squeezed along the floor walls. It's much prettier and sturdier. Purtier? Pur, purtier. And sturdier than the one we're staying in, but it's inhumanely small. The house seems to have been built for modestly large dolls. We have to hunch over to get in, and we can't move without bumping each other. That voice just builds up a lot of spit in my mouth. <laughs> I'm just, you know, uh, inside you, look. You need a re release valve. Yeah, this place was made for mostly sized dolls, see? Them dames that, uh, you know, are like uh, five foot eight and 300 pounds. That's not modestly sized at all. That's real big and full of muscle. Perfect. We also have two possibilities for how this happened. Possibilities? The possibility, which is weird, is that someone, possibly the captain, decided to make a 0.6 scale house on purpose for 0.6 humans, or dolls, or fun, and then turn it into storage. The possibility, which is scary, is that someone, possibly the captain, completely finished a 0.6 scale shack before realizing his measurements were off in the first place. The music is getting so loud and droning. It really is, yeah. It's not horrible, 
for me at this point. So I think we're okay. So, so loud. And droning, yes. If we find the tape, can you fix it? I think so. Hold on, I'm adjusting my pop filter. Filter. Do your job. Do your job. But it's kind of <laughs> worrying. It's kind of worrying it for for it to be. It's kind of worrying it. It's kind of worrying it for. It's kind of worrying. It's kind. Of, I can't say the line. God damn it. There, we're skipping it. Maybe we should call the captain. Oh, captain, my captain. Um, we could do that. Wow, that got really loud there. Yeah, yeah. What is happening? I don't but know. I'm gonna have to. Let's try justice. to get it working first. Is there like, is there like staticky ocean noises? What's happening? I'm a little worried, and I'm a little worried. God damn, it's so loud. Okay, it's done. I'm sure it'll be okay if I talk to him. You'll be fine. I promise. I believe in you. Huh. Really? Just search that drawer, Venus. We wrote through the drawers again, a little more intently. Are you scared of him? I am. Got it! Oh yeah, obviously the captain slash the devil is the music. I don't know who the captain is. Kirk, Picard, or Cisco? I just watched Wrath of Khan for the very first time the other night. Ooh. So, like, I understand some a little bit more pop culture than I did before. That's a very, very good movie. It was very good, yes. You know, those are Ricardo Montalban's actual abs and chest in that movie. Really? It's pretty good. Yeah, he said that when he got the role, he just when he learned he got the role, he just started doing push-ups every day. Nice. Yeah. He was in Spy Kids. I, uh, yeah, I remember. Oh, yay. Well, that was that whole scene. I almost have it. It's way easier than I thought. Phew. See? Nice. I'm glad. I really didn't want to have to go back to the captain. Ah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at Venus. They're so cute. <sighs> I don't know if it's really that I'm scared of him. Oh, I see. We're getting back into the personal conversation. Okay. But he does make me worry. <laughs> he just throws kerosene straight on the fire. Who does that? Up, oh, the music's getting loud again. Oh, um, he doesn't hate you or anything, I don't think. Okay. Uh, I'm sure the loud music is very relevant to what we're doing, but we're also recording a production for other people to hear. So, jazz hands for f that you can jazz see. hands <laughs> for people who are fans of this game. Jazz hands. <laughs> I mean, he's nicer to you than a lot of people. Why does everyone think that? He never got mad at me, but I don't like being liked by him. Okay, maybe it's because we're currently watching Utena. <laughs> but did you also ah! start raising your red? You gotta start raising your red flags. Ah, oh, Jesus. <laughs> the captain's name is Akio. Get out of here. Oh, man, I thought of another combination you'd kill me for. Go for it. Akio no face. Ah! <laughs> I warned you. You did. I... I, I was prepared not to say it. All right. It makes me think there must be something wrong with me. Oh. I don't want to be the sort of person that he likes. It makes me shiver. So are we looking to set a like a pedophile kind of way or a Jupiter is actually the devil kind of way? Um We're watching you Tenna. I know which way we're taking this. He likes people he can make a little uncomfortable and won't give any trouble about it. 
Uh, I was right. Yep. I was right. I was right. Yep. It swung directly over one side of the fence. Yep. Like us, I guess. Although, we probably swing on both sides of the fence. To be honest, this game does have a really big gay vibe. Yeah, yeah. Exactly us. We're the only people he likes, after all. I don't think he's gonna do anything terrible, Venus lied. <laughs> Optimistically. Um, no, he wouldn't, but... I don't know. Maybe he already did? Ah, no! Ah. No, and the music is getting loud again. Oh, God. Like, how you don't have to touch someone to touch someone? Red flags, children! Just waving, waving the red flags. Y you know? That sounds weird. Forget it. Don't forget it, Venus. Don't, don't forget. forget it. That that's that was about fifteen minutes. Yep. You want to call this an episode or? Um, th that's a pretty good place to cut an episode. So yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and cut here at nine p.m. 